Welcome to Firewalls.com. My name is Brian Reed and in this video we're going to show you how to increase your outbound streaming video performance without taxing your SonicWall firewall. So the problem with streaming video from the LAN side of your network is that the data that's coming from that video server is highly compressed. And as that data traverses the sonic wall, it's actually going through several different engines, including a malware scanning, a virus scanning, intrusion prevention scanning engines. Well, we know that the video that's streaming from that server really doesn't need to go through those three engines, but as it does, it requires the CPU utilization to spike on your SonicWell firewall. So the solution to this is to allow that traffic to bypass the SonicWell scanning engines so that it will lower the CPU utilization on your SonicWell firewall and overall increase the actual video throughput performance coming from that server. So let's take a look to see how that's done. In this walkthrough demonstration, I'm going to show you how we set up the SonicWall firewall to allow our video server that's residing on the LAN side of our network to bypass the three scanning engines, the antivirus, intrusion prevention, and spyware, so that we can maximize our video throughput without taxing the CPU on our SonicWall firewall. So the first thing we want to do is we want to disable the gateway antivirus. So in the admin console, we go to Security Services, Gateway Antivirus, and select the Configure Gateway AV settings. And we want to enable Gateway AV Exclusion List and select Add. Then you'll put in the IP address of the video server. Then select OK. The next engine we want to bypass is the Intrusion Prevention. So we'll go in, we'll configure the IPS settings. Enable the exclusion list, select add, put in the IP address of our video server on the LAN side. Then finally we want to bypass the anti-spyware engine. So again we'll select the configure anti-spyware settings, enable the exclusion list, select add, Finally, put in the IP address of our video server. And so now our sonic wall is set up to allow our video server at that LAN IP address to pass its traffic through the firewall without trying to scan the highly compressed video that's streaming from our video server. I'd like to thank you for watching our video. If you have any questions or comments, please enter them in the section below and have a great day.